Hello, everyone. My name is Manini Sharma, and I'm a product manager in the Autonomous Digital Experience Management team at Palo Alto Networks. Today, I'm going to walk you through ADIM's multi-domain analysis capability and introduce a new feature that greatly simplifies workflows for IT admins. Today, when a user raises a ticket about app access issues, the IT team follows several steps to find the root cause of the issue. First, the helpless team runs through a playbook for basic troubleshooting, and if the issue still remains unresolved, the issue is escalated to higher support levels. This is a multi-step process that can take up to four to five days to fully resolve this issue and close the ticket. With Palo Alto Network's ADEM solution, admins can quickly troubleshoot app access issues by running a multi-domain analysis to check the health and status of the endpoint, network, and application. In addition, ADEM also provides visibility into the security policies that are blocking a user's access to an application. But what if there is no block seen on the security policy? What if the policy rule is set to allow, but a real-time threat is seen in the traffic that is hindering a user's access to the application? For example, if a user is trying to access a news or media site and URL filtering blocks the user, or if a user downloads a day zero malware and is blocked by advanced threat prevention's inline ML capability, then the user may lose access to some resources. And today, it is difficult for IT admins to find this since they need to scan through thousands of threat and URL logs and may need to correlate this with the policy configuration as well. With the new Access Analyzer capability, this workflow is greatly simplified for admins. IT admins can now ask a query on Access Analyzer and we can surface the results, which include showing the reason for app access issues. On the query results page, the admin can clearly see that the user was hindered access to an application due to security profiles, virus, and spyware that were attached to certain security policy rules mentioned here. On the multi-domain analysis, we can see that ADEM was able to provide visibility into user and endpoint, network, as well as application. And we also see that there was visibility provided into security policies, and there is a clear indication of a deny on the security profile level. So this means that Palo Alto Network's Prisma Access Solution did a great job at determining that there were threats observed in the traffic, and hence, the user was hindered access to an application. But from an IT team perspective, when a ticket is raised, the IT team needs to realize the root cause of why the user was blocked access to this particular application. So in this case, we're able to clearly indicate that a user was blocked access due to virus and spyware seen as part of the logs. Now, clicking on this will further show you the logs. So here you can actually see the threat logs where you're able to see the log time as well as the security policy rule that it hit and the profile subtype. So by leveraging this multi-domain analysis capability, ADEM can easily show IT admins where an issue lies out of all of the different reasons that would block access to a user for a particular application. Thank you.